A lot of users have faced this issue that right after the iOS 26 update, their iPhone is showing different SIM failed error like no SIM, no service, no signal, etc. Here is how quickly you can fix it. Alright guys, so first, very basic, very handy. Just swipe down your control center and uh, turn on airplane mode, wait for around 5 to 10 seconds and then turn it back off once again. This will quickly restart and refresh the network. If that doesn't help, let's manually restart our physical SIM. Open settings. From there, go to cellular. If you can see your physical or eSIM in here, which is acting up, just enter its settings and simply turn off the line. Don't worry, just after 15 to 20 seconds, simply turn it back on and see now your SIM is recognized on your iPhone. If that doesn't help you, you now sometimes this happened for minor software glitch and in that case, let's force restart your iPhone. Quickly press and release the volume up and down button and press and hold the side or power button until the screen shows Apple logo. In most cases, after a force restart, the same problems are solved. If it didn't, and especially if you're using the SIM for a while with this iPhone, just grab a SIM ejector tool and then just go ahead, take out the physical SIM. And after a minute or two, simply reinstall it once again to your iPhone. Sometimes simply ejecting and reinstalling the physical SIM solves a lot of SIM failure error. Now, just in case you've tried a lot of settings and uh, none of this helped for you, Lastly, we're going to go for a reset network settings. So open up settings from there to general. Scroll down to transfer a reset iPhone. Tap on reset. And from here, what you're going to do is just reset network settings. Just make sure you got your Wi-Fi password because this will remove it. After the reset network settings, give your iPhone a minute or to register to the network. And unless your physical SIM is damaged, you will no longer have any same failure error after that. Thanks for watching.